welcome to a new video this week. Yesterday I didn't make one because I was really without inspiration, but today we got the patch. So I figured it would be cool to uh, see what new items we all got. So I think I got them all thousands. It was a hell of a job, but I did it for you and for myself because I just was curious to see what was in it. And a lot is in it. So as you can see, there are a lot of trees and rocks and bushes and all that kind of sort of thing. Uh, there are a couple background uh, stuff like the ruins uh, in Windenburg, really awesome. And also uh, a lot of stuff like uh, boats, cars uh, and a lot of rocks. <laughs> Uh, you will see that in the last two minutes, it's almost all rocks. They're awesome though. And um, you can access them to uh, type in uh, testing cheats and then show hidden objects. And after that, you type in BB dot show live objects. No, that's wrong. Show live edit objects. That's the one. Uh, I'm a bit of disappointed it comes with an extra cheat and with hidden objects because I really don't like to use the hidden objects cheat because you get a lot of clutter that you really don't need, at least I don't use it. So I really hope they would have just integrated all the items into the game because now you can't search for them. Um, so you have to go through the whole list to find the rock or the bush or the tree or the ship you want and I think that's a really bit redundant if I'm honest. I'm kind of disappointed that they just made a button for it or uh, a cheat on their own um, because now it's still a whole lot of work to find stuff you want or what is in it so that's why I made this video too so you can see what kind of objects are in it and if it's something for you to use. I saw some objects that really sparked my interest and my uh, inspiration. So I'm gonna use the cheats, but I'm, um, yeah, I'm not really happy how they did about it, but I'm really thankful and grateful that they made the objects available for us because a lot of things that were in the game, in the environment and such, uh, are so beautiful and awesome to use. You will see some objects that you know I'm referring to right now because they're totally awesome and I saw a lot of objects you can use for weddings or beautiful environments and, and that sort of thing. And I think for people who like to build on the water, all the underwater stuff from Sulani is also in there. So I think a lot of people will be happy with that as well. A lot of stuff from uh, Jungle Adventure, and from Cats and Dogs, from uh, Get Together 2, Windham, uh, of, um, Get to Work, not so much. And I didn't see a lot of seasons as well, but that's normal I guess because that pack wasn't really focused on uh, building, but more on the seasons. So. That isn't a big surprise. Uh, and we have a bit of stuff from... Uh, I'm forgetting the name of the pack. Oh, the one with all the weird plants. <laughs> that one. <laughs> Why don't I... I just don't know. I can't remember. Well, you know the pack, I mean. The one with weird plants and the mother plant and all that sort of thing. Uh, I think we got a lot of cars from that uh, and a little bit of fences as well but I also saw there are a lot of double things in it so a thousand objects I don't know because there are, there are at least three packs that use similar um, fences or something like that uh, just in a little bit of a different color so mm, eh. Thousand is a bit much, I, but it's still a lot and my hand is sore from all the clicking and looking and clicking and scrolling. <laughs> but it, is fun. it was fun to do also, because I really needed 
some new stuff to get my creativity going again and some inspiration for new builds and I got that and I'm really curious to see what the rest of the community is going to do with it because it's a lot of fun stuff and I think uh, the stuff we got uh, really uh, is useful for some special builds like maybe build your own harbor or um, all that sort of thing or your own um, military camp or no, whatever you can think of a lot of things when you see the objects or use them in different way we also got a lot of uh, bridges with them really awesome uh, the one from uh, Sulani are in it and from Windenburg I believe so those are really cool and maybe one from cats and dogs although I'm not sure if that one is from cats and dogs and if you're a gothic uh, lover you will be really happy with this too because a lot of things came out in the vampire pack as well um, yeah so that's it I'm not really sure what I should tell you more about it and I'm sorry for my cat because he thinks this is a good moment to scratch his box <sighs> well all you fluff owners will know that this is happening quite often especially when you are recording then they find it's the best place to sit on your keyboard or for your screen or just go mow or <laughs> just get your attention so well he stopped so i want to thank you for watching and uh, i hope it's useful for you and it sparks your creativity as well and i'm really curious to see what you're going to do with it and i wish you a very good night at least for here in the western hemisphere uh, it may be a good day if it's morning at your place. And I hope you have a very good rest of the week. It's just started so you have to go a while be before it's Friday. I'm sorry, but we will get there together. So for this is the last thing I will say. And thank you again. And I will see you soon.